In this video, we will prove the third equation of motion, which is b square minus u square is equals to 2 as. This is for an object moving with uniform acceleration. We know that acceleration is defined as a is equals to change in velocity by change in time. Now we will break this dv dt dv times dt. Here we will write ds and here it is ds. So we have break this dv dt in such a way that so that it doesn't affect it. So ds ds can be cancelled out so dv dt. Now in the next step we can write ds dt we know that change in displacement by change in time is velocity. So we can replace it dv ds into this would be v. Now in the next step we can cross multiply it so ds into a so a ds is equals to v d v so this is our equation one now when time was zero the velocity of the object was initial velocity which is u and the distance traveled was zero now when time is equals to suppose t velocity is b and distance traveled is suppose s now we will integrate the equation 1 with this limits. So equation 1 was a d s is equals to v d v. Now integrating the equation 1, so d s is limits is 0 up to s and v d v is limit is u to v. Now a is a constant, so a will get outside, so integration will be 0 up to s d s. And here integration u to v, v d v. So DSS integration is S, so it will be S and limit is 0 up to S and VDV's integration is V square by 2, integration limit U up to V. Now let's put the limit, so A upper minus lower S minus 0 is equals to V square by 2 minus U square by 2. Now in the next step we can write A times S is equals to half of v square minus u square now let's cross multiply it so v square minus u square is equals to 2as this is our third equation of motion